Hello. Welcome. <laughs> so, I tried getting my green screen to work. This is a PlayStation live stream, by the way. My computer is updating, so I don't have a thumbnail. But thank you guys for joining. <laughs> um, I'm over at my dad's house. Uh, I actually used to stream here quite a bit when I first started streaming. And uh, he has amazing internet. I tried doing a test stream last week, or a couple days ago, uh, in my bedroom, and that did not go well. So today, I moved everything to my dad's house, and uh, we're, we're doing this again. So I apologize if you guys can see my green screen. I tried, like, getting rid of it, but for some reason, like, it's not going away. So I'll take care of this today. After this stream, I'll probably get like a better background or something. I can't really fix it, but yeah. <laughs> Hi guys, how's it going? So we're playing the Sinking City, AKA the test stream game. This is a good game. We're just gonna see how it goes, but fire the internet connection. Seems pretty good. I did a test and it's so much better than my house. So I don't think there's gonna be any problems, but today is just kind of like, my first day back, I took a week off because I've been dealing with like some health problems, but um, you know, I'm all better. I feel really good today. And yeah, we're gonna be doing this. Um... <laughs> Mega Fluffy Slug says, I'll test your pit pit in my butt. Oh, get that profanity out of here. How dare you? I'm just kidding. <laughs> We're gonna, yeah, we're gonna see how this, like, stream goes today. So yeah, I apologize about my background. You know, I have a green screen up for a reason, and for some reason, it won't pick up. You know, like, it, it should, like, be invisible, but it won't go away. So I'm gonna, I'll try to fix that. So today, today is just kind of like a test stream. Yeah, anyway. Hi, guys. Disgusting. Yeah, so disgusting. How dare you. Lolo's here, hi! Yeah, I can't even update my thumbnail or anything. I can't do anything to like my uh, description stuff because my freaking computer is updating. It's at 22% and I don't have all day to wait because, you know, I have to go pick up Kaden at school. Um, but hi guys, Mr. Spock is here! Hi everybody! Yeah, we're just gonna be playing this game. It's a spooky game. It's, it's, uh, it's, it reminds me of like Bloodborne with, um, Fallout. So if you guys like those two games, I think you guys would like this game as well. Uh, but yeah, this is a spooky game. Can you guys hear me just fine? Can you hear me? I can see the background. Yeah, exactly. So you guys can see my background. That's the thing. I apologize because I tried, uh, I tried getting rid of it, but it won't go away. <laughs> my green screen. It's supposed to be invisible because it's like, you know, it's a green screen. It won't go away though, so yeah. Sorry about that. Yeah, I think it's like my PlayStation. It, because like, I'm using a new camera. It's not a new camera, I have like two PlayStation cameras, just in case if one breaks, it's good to have a backup. Uh, but yeah, like it's not even like working on this camera. So I think it's something to do with my PlayStation, unfortunately. Um, <laughs> well, this is like, this is more of like an action like horror game, if anything. I don't know, I guess it's kind of like a survival horror, I guess you could say that. What, time to rage on some Call of Duty? You're gonna play Call of Duty? Oh my god. <laughs> anyway, let's just see how this goes. We're gonna go ahead and continue. We kind of started a new game the last time we were playing, so we're still really like in the beginning of the game. You guys didn't really miss much if you guys are just tuning in, but let's go ahead and get into this, shall we? I don't know, I might, um, I might move my camera around just to kind of like see if I'm blocking anything on the screen. Cause I can see myself, I can see myself on the screen. That's how like PlayStation is. Uh, how am I doing today? I'm doing good. I feel really good today. Like last week I was kind of like, I had to go to like three different doctor's appointments <laughs> all in one week. So I was really busy. And that's why, like, I wasn't streaming. So I apologize. Sorry about that, guys. Gotta, gotta take care of my health. Gotta make sure everything is good, you know? My computer's at 23%. Woo! Yeah, it's probably, it's, I'm not gonna have a thumbnail for this stream. Honestly, I think this is just gonna be, like, a, you know, basic stream, I guess. <laughs> 
It's good to see you too, Mike. Oh, Mike. Spock is here. Okay. I think I remember how to play. I always forget the controls of a game. Whenever I, like, stop playing it for a couple of days, even if it's just, like, two days, I'm like, okay, what's the running button? What's the crouch button? Hopefully I don't forget, because this game is kind of scary. Okay, what are we doing? So this is our character. We're playing as a detective back in the 20th century during Prohibition days. And if you guys don't know what this game is about, it's pretty much like a Cthulhu game. So it's like, this shit takes place in uh, Massachusetts, right? The city had like a mysterious flood with all these like monsters coming out of nowhere. And we are here to investigate what is going on. That is pretty much the story. I don't know the ending. I haven't finished this game. Um, yeah, this is the fish per- this is, uh, yeah, this has fish people in it. And, like, all this shit started happening, you know, after this, like, mysterious flood, apparently. You know, according to legend, it's Cthulhu in the game. Okay, so let's see what we're doing really quick. Um, I don't even know what we're doing right now, to be honest. We have to... I'm trying to think. Let's see, a key for the room on the upper floor of the bar where Lewis is hiding. I might have to, okay, so we're trying, this is the beginning of the game. We're investigating a murder. This is like the first mission we're assigned. So we're still in the very beginning. Um, we have to find out who killed this guy's son. And this is kind of like the start of like everything, like why everything the way it is. Let's see, I think we already talked to him, I don't know. Um, so we gotta go confront the killer. We kinda discovered who killed this guy's son, and it's like a fish guy. Good morning, El Garcia. Happy Halloween. Happy early Halloween. Let's see if we talked to him already. I think we did. I don't know, but let's see. The townspeople got freaked with the fish. So like, no, no, no. Apparently the people, the fish people came to this town. So it's not like the people like did it with any fish. You know, they weren't getting into anything fishy if you catch my drift, but <laughs> they, these like fish people started coming to the town after the flood. Hey, who are you? Here we go. Okay. Doing? So Charles this guy Reed, apparently is a murderer. Oh shit. Mr. Throgmorton hired me to find his Throgmorton is like this half man, half ape guy. I'm not even kidding. His mom's an ape. That darn bartender. Like bestiality, like his mom's a legit ape. crazy ape's fault. You hear me? Calm down. I only want to speak for now. But no, if you reach for your gun, you hit <laughs> I love this guy's expression. Say poetic justice. I love his I expression. Isn't he hot? That fish guy? Isn't he just so hot? All right, so we got a question. Albert is the victim who died. We found him dead, and he was hidden in a basement. And we kind of figured out, like, we can we have a sixth sense. We can kind of see things that people can't see, like what happened. And I don't know. It's it's really you. You guys will see. We'll we'll go through like a lot more. Um, <laughs> why do you look like that? That's so a uh, forward. But you know what? What kind of? Uh, why do you? Your face, it's, uh... Oh, so you're here to attack me just because I look different to you. That's not it, I swear. You on me, whisper to your friends? What's new? Uh, no, no, I'm sorry. I, I I didn't know how to ask. I've just never met someone like you before. I didn't mean any offense. Innsmouther's bodies were blessed by the she. Ew. You're going to see a lot of us here, so you better get over it. We are proud of who we are. Would you guys get down and dirty with an insmouther? All right. Uh, how? Why did you kill Albert? No shot to kill. No warning. No second chances. You pursued Albert even after he fled. Why? I. Well, I can't remember it. When he woke, it was like a, a bloody mist descended over me. First thing I recall. After Fishman looks the exact warehouse. thing from my nightmare. <laughs> covered in blood. Don't say that. Don't be mean. I had no Stop idea it. what happened. Or 
I suspect it has something to do with that ape. Throgmorton. I was right. How did Start it happen? What happened? We, we... We were in our house, me, Paul, and Will. Mary'd gone to the sea. Though I told him that it would only bring bad luck. If he'd listened to me, we'd all still be alive. Come on, Lewis. Focus. His name's Lewis. Right. Well, Mary dragged that damn ape to our house. He was bragging about how much Scorpion, thank you for the two dollars. Here's a donut to get noticed. Love you. Oh, love you too, Scorpion. Thank you. <laughs> then woke in an instant and started screaming, attacking us. Hmm. After that, can't remember a thing. Okay. Um, your actions look deliberate. The things you did to Albert don't look like a bloody rage. A fatal shot to the head, a hidden body. One might start to wonder if it was deliberate. I like his eyebrows. I don't know what to say. I wasn't myself. Uh, why do you people hate the Throgmorton? So the Throgmortons are, they're a family in the city that, like I said, like they're, they come from a lineage of apes. I'm not even kidding. You guys, I played this game before. I haven't finished it. I think I got like maybe not even a quarter into the game. It's a pretty long game. But you find out that, like, you know, the person who was killed, his dad is, like, half ape, half human. And it's kind of, you know, it's kind of weird. It's kind of weird. <laughs> I'm going to be honest, it's really I weird. I there's a bit of a feud between the Innsmouthers and the Throgmortons. Care to fill me in? Those Have a great day, us. everybody. Thank you, Scorpion. Our home was destroyed. We just needed a place to stay. The Blackwood Grand family sheltered us, but... Others were not as hospitable. We needed jobs, food, and medicine. Hospitable. The city denied it all. And so? We had to fight for every crumb of bread. And those Throgmortons in their high castle only made our life harder. Always conspiring behind our backs. Always setting people against us. I'd love to see them suffer like we suffer. What's a grand family? Okay, so this is gonna explain the Throgmortons and pretty much the important families of this weird city. You mentioned a grand family. What do you mean? I gotta ask the fishman what his mouth so, do. Yeah. <laughs> I gotta know, are those real? <laughs> a newcomer with Who a is your doctor? Answer the question. Answer the question. <laughs> okay. People here are crazy about bloodlines and tradition and reputation. The head hunters of Oakmont called the grand families. There's the carpenters who control most of the city's underworld. Those lips are grand. The Blackwoods who share kin with Innsmouthers <laughs> through the Marsh family. And God damn, guess, what'd that mouth do? The Throgmortons. Right, those filthy apes. Now that most of the Blackwoods are gone, there's nobody left to protect <laughs> Will us. Will Wavis says Inspector Gadget has the fuckboy eyebrows. <laughs> he does! I know! He really does. With like the shame shit right there. <laughs> I think I've got all I need. He's cool though, Mr. I like Reed, it. Don't tell Throgmorton about me. I know I'm in no position to ask. I didn't want to do whatever it is. So I he did. killed his son, Honest, but he was like have mercy, please. He was like possessed. I have a family. Which I actually believe because this town I has like some star. weird force kind of like controlling the people. I'll think about it. Oh shit. Should we be like cause I know you can actually try to get like bullets from this dude. And I, I could use all the bullets I can get. Oh, huh, no, I can't. I can't be me. I won't tell him. Everyone seems to agree there's been an outbreak of madness around these parts. Don't forget to hit that like button. To Guys, it. let's get some Plus, likes for this stream. This is a test stream, so family after what I would appreciate it. <laughs> oh, thank you, Mr. Reed. Thank you. Now give me uh, all your bullets. Still close. Bullets are like money. Oh, They're worth do. like more right than here, money. Because of the monsters in this town. The streets Spike are flooded with police. I'll make something up to tell Throgmorton. <clears throat> Leave as soon as you can. Thank you again, sir. His eyes are like... I won't forget this. <laughs> Mind pause. All right. How do you go into it? So this is our sixth fence. We can see things that no one else can see. Ew. The hell? She's like... 
the more we do that, we have an insanity bar. If you guys can see the two bars at the bottom left, the red bar is our health bar. The blue bar is our sanity bar. So I think we can actually die. We can go crazy and die if that bar is like either like gone or if it's low enough. Um, so it's kind of like, it's like amnesia a little bit. Deal some stuff. Cause we are the baddest cops in Boston. We're near Boston. We the baddest of the bads. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Another day, another bullet. All right. Let's see. Another day, another crime solved. Lore. Fortune teller's prophecy. This lady is like, I was the fortune teller and tell me why. She's like, I don't want your money. I want your bullets. And I was like, oh, I only have six, please. I think I can make bullets, right? Pistol. Shit. That's it, I, I only have nine bullets in my gun out of 21. Lewis was affected by hysteria. Lewis was aware of what he was doing. I don't, okay, here's the thing. I think whatever you determine, whatever, it's one of those games where it's like, whatever choices you choose, that'll determine like the ending and the outcome and kind of like the playthrough. I really think that like this, that fish guy was being honest because you guys, if you guys weren't here during the last stream, we kind of figured out that like people are getting like visions, like the same shit, same visions. So that kind of tells you that there is something going on. Um, I could totally just like rat him out and be like, he's a, he is a murderer, but he didn't mean to do it. Just like how I didn't mean to drink this cup of coffee. <laughs> Josh is here. Hi, Josh. Like Spike, or the fishman will kiss you. His lips look juicy. <laughs> I'm just kidding. They do. He's fresh from the water. Lewis was mentally affected and couldn't entirely control his actions. That's what I'm thinking. So now, our conclusion for the murder. Lewis was under mental influence. Lewis killed Albert Throgmorton while under some sort of mental influence. He couldn't control his actions and thus can't be blamed for Albert's death. I could try and cover for him or else Robert will have his head, which is true. I, I don't want this guy to die. I would feel really bad. <clears throat> so let's go, uh, shut up. Let's go talk to the dad. You guys are gonna see what I mean by, like, the ape in his blood. And he's pretty proud of it, too. He's like, my family comes from a lineage of royalty. Oh. <laughs> the murderer is dead. Murderer is at the bar. Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye. I tracked the murderer down. Was attacked by those things prowling the back alleys. And they tore him apart. It was that Innsmouther fisherman, Lewis, who was covered in your son's blood that may have attracted the beasts. Are you certain the body is his? Beyond any doubt. All that's left of him is a heap of flesh and a scrap of cloth. That's from his jacket. You must ask his friends. Alas. This was Isn't my revenge to exact, not some wild beasts. Something must be done about those pests. Still, justice has been served. This isn't closure. But at least I know now the story. Thank you. Mr. Throgmorton, I hate to press you, but do you think you could help me now? Yes, you've earned it. Okay, to think a newcomer barely off the boat solves a crime the police couldn't, Kate Lulu. but I digress. Remind me, what brought you to a world? I came here for your sideburns. 
God, my computer is still updating. It's at 84%. I'm trying to find the source of my visions. I'm investigating cases of insanity. Um, you know, technically we're doing both. <laughs> we're doing both, but it kind of sucks that we have to pick one over the other. Because I think that's going to affect kind of like the storyline of everything. I think during my first playthrough, I never finished this game. I think I got like towards the quarter of the game. Um, not even. I think I picked this one. But they're both pretty, like, I mean, they both kind of add on to, like, what's, there's something going on here. I'm investigating cases of insanity. I'm trying to find the source of my visions. Uh, I don't know, because, like, they're both, like, good reasons to be there, you know? I'm more, I really want to do this one. I really want to know, like, why... I am getting the visions. And people, the thing is, like, people have the same visions as me. So I don't want to say, like, there's insanity going around. There's... And they're both, I don't know. Investigating? Because people are going crazy, kind of. What's up, Doughboy? Mm, Doughboy, I have a question. Is that a gorilla in a suit? He's not a gorilla. He's half. <laughs> he comes from a royal family. That's what he described his mom. I come from a royal lineage. My father chose, <laughs> you know, like, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know which one to pick, guys. Hi, Kool-Aid. I'm investigating cases. Well, I mean, like, I picked that one before and like nothing bad happened. I'm we'll do this one. I'm an outbreak of erratic behavior and madness. All linked to shared visions of this place. Okay. Indeed. Then our goals align. This inexplicable hysteria has spread through Ogmont after the flood. I funded an expedition to explore recent geological activity that may be responsible. Can you imagine? I have a feeling we're gonna have to fight this guy later in the game. I think he's gonna go crazy. Because his son went crazy and he, like, attacked people, and that's why he died. I have a feeling we're going to have to fight this big man of an ape. <laughs> you know. Why a geological expedition? Any link between visions and hysteria? Why a geological, geological expedition? expedition? I'm not sure I follow. I Hi, Aramis. I the flood and this madness of the same source. As above, so below. So I sent men to find out. You think the flood is a natural? The flood. You think it's more than just a natural disaster. You weren't here, Mr. Reed. What happened? Defied scientific explanation. Yo mama defied scientific explanation. Um any leak between visions and hysteria, any discoveries so far. Found anything? I do not know. Albert is Albert was part of it. His passing cannot be coincidence. Why was he alone at the port? And where are the others? Okay, I think my computer's done updating. Yay. Um, the murder and the expedition are linked. Any link between Did visions and hysteria? Does this case of hysteria involve shared visions as well? Since the flood, many Oakmonters have had similar nightmares. Indeed, Professor Doe, the expedition leader, complained of them herself. Waterlogged ruins with unnatural architecture. A sleeping giants, drowned streets, and a voice calming from the depths. Her words exactly. She proposed the expedition, desperately wanting to find the cause. The murder and the expedition are late. Your son was killed because the expedition uncovered something. Is it so hard to believe? I had no news for a week that Albert, the only one I could trust, comes ashore and is killed. It does sound suspicious. Mr. Reed, I want you to find out what's going on. I expect you're as interested in the expedition's results as I am. Okay. Let's talk payment. <laughs> How's your night going? It's going, oh, my day's going good. What time is it? Noon? It's noon already? God 
science. Tell me more about the expedition. If I'm going to look into this, I'll need to know more. Where should I start? I'll give you the address of the expedition's headquarters and a key. That's all you can tell me? Let me be clear, Reed. You do not speak to me like that. Hi, Dirk. Mr. What? Dick Morton. I just meant the more I know, the better. I am a busy man. I funded the research, but left all preparations to Professor Doe and Albert. When you've finished, come see me at the Throgmorton family manor. It's in Old Grove. Here, I'll show you. What Let's talk payment. They will be reimbursed after you complete your task. <laughs> and of course, you've earned some compensation for your work here at the port. I'll also include a fair advance in bullets. Yes! Bullets! Yes, the dollar lost its use here, Mr. Reed. After the flood, Oakmont returned to bartering. Bullets mean more than bills. Oh, bye, but we're about to get paid in bullets. Oh, honey. Alright, so we have to go to our hotel room, which is gonna be our, like, house. Um... So, yeah, one thing I like about this game is that uh, you can only fast travel after you find the location that you're going to. And uh, the only way to find wherever you're trying to go to, if you've never been there before, is by street name. So it's like you kind of have to follow directions and like the map right here. Do you guys see how big this place is? Do you see? all of these streets <laughs> so it's gonna be it actually is pretty fun to figure out where you're going where everything is because you know you're kind of like learning more about the city um but yeah like let's see so we have to go to coverside northern coverside which is like a district in the city at the crossroad of asher road and hubert's coverside asher and hubert's so right here. Like literally like right there. Wait, danger? No. Edit. It's uh No, it's not danger. No. Go back. It's literally There we go. <laughs> All right. So we got some Wait, can we level up? Can we level up? Skills. Oh baby, we can level up. Alright. So, what is this stuff? Um, carry up to 25 pieces of any crafting material. Um, let's see what this one is. When close to death, slowly regenerate a limited amount of health for one last fighting chance. Carry seven more pistol rounds. What, what is this one? Set traps twice as quickly. Keep an extra bullet loaded, gaining a chance to deal double damage with the pistol. Chances 10 plus 5. 10%. Dude, is my computer done? It is! It's done updating! Yay! I can edit my stream. I'm so happy. Hell yeah. Wow, still quite a map and possibly a great journey. Yeah, yeah. It's gonna be... This game is quite a game. It's pretty fun. Um, okay, let's look at this stuff. Earn more experience and stay sane for slightly longer. I think I'm gonna do that one. Let's see. Gain a 50% chance to double class reward items. Remain sane for much longer. We're gonna do... We're gonna do that. <laughs> yeah. Alright, boys. Let's go. Oh, wait. Let me... You know, I can actually, whoops. Am I not connected to the internet? Shoot, I have to connect myself to the internet. Um, we can actually unlock skins, like different skins. Your character can like change into like, you know, I guess like if you complete certain quests, you can unlock like outfits, which is like, I wanna do that first so I can look the part. <laughs> Alright, I need to put in my Wi-Fi password um, on my computer. God, this is so blurry. This picture is so blurry. Alright, 
right, hopefully I didn't, like, mistype that. Okay, good. Yay! Awesome! Oh. Oh, snap. Okay. So, let me upload a thumbnail and edit my description really quick. You can kind of see, like, how bright everything is on my, uh, on my face. I look really bright, sorry. <laughs> All right, thumbnail, where is my thumbnail? I'm just gonna use my thumbnail from last week. That should be, yeah, that should be good. And then I have to have to put in like my description out of that stuff you know do all that good stuff what the heck was my character doing oh I can open up chat on my computer this is uh, you can buy this you can buy this game on the PlayStation Network but um, no it's not an online game I think it's it's a single-player game but it's still a really fun game you know all right so we're playing the sinking sitter the sinking butt the sinking flood study. Yeah, baby. Here we go. The sinking booty. What's up, Joe? And Samuel? And Kayla? Hi, guys! I got my computer working, so I am gonna open up chat on here. I wish I had this in dark mode so I can, uh, here we go, dark mode, yay! Now it won't look so bright on me. <laughs> yes. Okay, I want to zoom in on the chops. You'd never seen this game before? This game wasn't really, you know, it's a really good quality game, but I didn't really hear about it until, like, the day before it was released, like, back in, uh, June or July. And, uh, it's- it's a really good game. I think it's definitely- I don't know if it's- if it's considered an indie game. I want to say, like, it does have, like, its fan base to it. <laughs> you know? Every day is going well. It's been a while since I've been to your streams. Dropping a like. Thank you! Thank you, thank you. Okay, so we have to go to this key up here. This is where our hotel is. So we're just gonna go. We're just gonna, we're just gonna go. Let's do it. And I think it's like GTA where you can like pop out your weapons like that with like L1. Why is your hair up? Could you not do anything with your hair? Could I not do anything with my hair? <laughs> Am I supposed to do something with my hair? <laughs> do I have to? I don't know. Can I not have my hair up in a ponytail? Uh oh. Oh no! Oh shit. Ew. Oh, that fiend. Dude, that's like Oklahoma! That's like a tornado! Okay, that's not- Ew! <laughs> it's like a- It's like a butthole. <laughs> it's like a butthole with teeth. Ew! <laughs> Nasty! <laughs> They, d they don't call it Big Booty Cthulhu for nothing. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Can you imagine? Yeah, I was gonna say, that looks like Oklahoma, and then the big Cthulhu mouth, like, yeah, I did not see that coming. Can I borrow your glasses? Mike, why do you ask that all the time? All the time. Cthulhu can get it. 
you're gonna need a bigger <laughs> a bigger body for Cthulhu that's all I'm gonna say <laughs> okay we're in the hotel room this is it so we don't even have to wait is that it oh then what's this over here the key to the headquarters Northern Coverside, Crossroads of Asher and Heber. Oh, to the headquarters. Okay, so that's um, for something completely different. I thought that was for the inn. So this is our room, guys. Lock up to my room. Crew of the Cyclops. Semper Fortis, brothers. I have a feeling that, like, his whole Navy days is, like, one big hallucination. Like, what if he killed his, like... All that we see or seem is just a dream within a dream. Charles W. Reed. Never again, they say. Okay. Okay, so this is our closet. So, the outfit I want to get that I had before was the doctor, the plague doctor. Ah, he's so cool. I love this one. But all of these are pretty cool. Um, I had this one and... <laughs> Look at this one. <laughs> Um, and I think I had this one as well, which is like a really fancy outfit. But I really like the Plague Doctor, it's really cool. Um, we have to go to the hospital if we're gonna be unlocking that. So we just have to... Can we go in here? <laughs> we just have to do a bunch of quests to, uh, you know, unlock them. Why is it her last stream? My last stream? What are you talking about? My last stream. Oh, I feel bad stealing all this stuff, but you know what? Every man for himself. And what is this? I boarded up the windows and locked the door. They are just men, the Yellow Kings gang. They can't get here now. Now there's only me, me, and these nightmares a little longer, and I'll figure them out. Oh, so that's a clue. I didn't even, like, realize that was a clue. I, I played this before, but I never finished it. Door won't budge. What is that? Mr. Archer, I've seen you dragging things into your room. Mind the floors. I'll make you pay for any scratches you leave. Your landlord. Can I go in here? I can't even go in here. He's confused about your title being last stream. Oh, last test stream. Well, it's the title, The Last Test Stream, so we're not going to be doing a test stream after this. Hopefully not. Um, yeah, that doesn't mean it's going to be my last stream ever. Yeah, I thought it was pretty clear about that. Okay, let's see. It's a briefcase, guys. Gunpowder. What is this? Too many coincidences, so the lighthouse is out. Several ships have got lost at sea, and some are now decorating. The city's beaches, that's one thing, but now there's an enterprising fellow at the city port hiring salvagers to recover ships. He's turning a tidy profit from selling them. Can't be a coincidence, need to look into it. Oh, interesting. Okay. This is creepy. This whole hotel is creepy. Okay, I think we're on the third floor. Is there anything in here that we can look at? into? Ew. Okay. Let's get out of here. Um, can we go here? No? Okay. Let's go downstairs. Let's go start our quests that we're doing, um, so we can unlock our Plague Doctor costume, cause that's my favorite costume. I feel so in character with Finally, it. Finally, you're awake. Gotta tell you, though, mister. You want to stay on here? You stop making all that noise. Back to the regular streams? Yes! Yes! Okay, um, what noise? Noise? What, what noise are you talking about? I expect my guests to be respectable. Moans, chanting, all that kind of thing. It stops, all right? Huh? I didn't do anything. Got any proof it was me? It could have been one of my neighbors. I slept like a rock. I, I didn't hear a thing. <sighs> That's exactly what a newcomer would say. 
Your neighbors are respectable people and would never do such a thing. Don't think your yellow-clad patron means you get away with everything. You're so exactly rude. friendly with your guests. Are we the ones keeping you in business? All these rumors after the flood. They're stark raven mad. What do you mean? You can't imagine. Because that reminds me of Indiana Jones. And books I find it is that time period. About. Only thing they're good for is lighting a kitchen stove. Can I have a look? I knew it. I tell you, no one sane would be interested. And you want to take a look? <laughs> well, fine, fine. Take what you wish. This guy is. <laughs> I don't know. What's wrong with him? What is this? My dear Victor, how is Oakmont treating you? Should you require any support, the Blackwoods will be happy to help you. I have arranged for that. So regarding your question, I don't know where Roberts went. Sadly, only that he did not stay in Inmel. Perhaps there is hope he didn't perish in that cursed raid. Um. Aunt Portia. Okay. That guy looked like a fish guy. I think he's like part fish guy, maybe? Probably. Oh, baby, we're about to get some stuff. This man looks like he's seen some shit. He, well, you know, there's... <laughs> there's people in this town called the Innsmouthers. They're pretty much like fish people. They look like fish. So he's probably one of them. And then there's Throgmortons, which is like a family that comes from like a lineage of apes. <laughs> Not even kidding. Can we jump over this? Can we? No? Okay. Um... So this is our sixth sensibility. We're gonna go to the hospital because... <clears throat> because, um... I want to... Actually, let's delete that. We gotta go... Can we fast travel there? I wonder. Because it's like on the map. No, we can't fast travel there. Damn it! Um, alright. Well, let's see. Is it this way? Yeah, it is. Alright, we have to be careful because there are areas in this town that are quarantined. Cool open world? Kind of. Like, this city is really big. This is a really big city. And most of it is flooded like this. It's pretty cool. Infested area, that's what it's called. So there are going to be like monsters and stuff here. So we gotta be super careful. So you guys haven't really seen anything yet. This game gets kind of hardcore. <laughs> There's like tentacles in the water and shit. And you actually go underwater to like a expedition cave that like scientists discovered. Like it gets really in depth and really cool. All right, so the next street, we gotta make a left. I wish we had like a little map. This guy fishing right over there. Well, I don't think we can fast travel uh, unless if it's like a fast travel point. So like a telephone booth, I think that's like the only way to fast travel when you're in this game. Which I, I like because it's like a survival horror. Are we still in an infested area? Oh dear lord. The hell? Oh, my sister was texting me. This is on PS4! I don't know if it's only on PS4. Oh my god. <laughs> Kelly, my sister is texting me. Ah, uh, there should be a phone booth somewhere over here. Uh, maybe we can find one really quick. I hope we can. Oh my god! Please stop! <laughs> my phone's like right next to my. No, I'm gonna put it on silent. Putting my phone on silent. There we go. If you guys might hear a buzz because it's my sister texting me. She's sending Kate in a Halloween costume. All right, we're 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 trying to look for a phone booth because that is our fast travel point. Oh, that's oh. That's nasty. Find something you like. All right, I see a fast travel point, like a compass thing up here. So let's go check it out. 
and unlock it so we don't have to run all the way over here next time. Infested area? Huh? There's people here, though. Okay, good. We got... There's a phone booth right there. So this game, guys, there's a lot of glitches in this game that's pretty hilarious. We might come across some pretty pretty fun glitches. I've seen a uh, I've seen some pretty interesting stuff in this game. So here's the hospital. We got to unlock that plague doctor costume that I want. Patient or visitor? Hold on, hold on. Let Dr. Grant guess. A visitor. Mustache. Though you Mustache. are a bit pale, you don't have a headache, do you? Oh my god. I guess. The usual. Nothing to write home about. Ah, a chronic headache sufferer. <laughs> Fascinating. Uh, by coincidence, I was studying Helminth and their role in illness uh, before the flood. Uh, did you know that all of us are infected by Helminth? Y your headaches could indicate that they have infested your brain. That's news to me, Doc. Sounds serious. Hmm. May I suggest you become a subject in my experimental medical program? <laughs> what do you guys think? <laughs> I won't be a lab rat. I, th I chose no before because I don't really want to... Um, I don't want anything happening to me. There's another game just like this called The Call of Cthulhu. It it's definitely... I don't know if it's part of that game, but... People are saying that, like, this is, like, a game that's, like, you know, it kind of crosses, like, that whole, uh, what do you call it, like, storyline with Cthulhu and all that stuff. You want to try it? I don't know if I have time for this, though. <laughs> that's going to be a hard no from you? Nah, I, think I don't want to do it. I don't want to do it. Live lab rat in an asylum in Boston. Love crafty and horror. Exactly. That's exactly. I I couldn't find the word. It seems as though but, your yeah. brain is already too damaged by the helminth for <gasps> rational thought. <laughs> it looks okay. like hard work in these conditions. You need a hand? Well, yes, actually, but it may result in close contact with the wiles. Is that going to be a problem? No. I'm prepared to face men and beasts alike. Count me in. Huh? I can see it in your eyes. Well, I have taken it upon myself to study the wild beasts, but need more data to confirm two of my hypotheses. One have a great stream. I got things to do. All right. And the other, have a good the day. Vomiting humanoids. Uh, multi-handed creatures vomiting humanoids. Those hideous wretches seem almost human. But what could turn one into such a monstrosity? Jim Bells, a patient of mine, was admitted to hospital with symptoms resembling cholera, but he turned into one of those things. Incredible. Here's the address. Yes. Find out what happened. <laughs> what have you found out about the multi-handed beasts? One of my patients saw them in his huh. nightmares before the flood. I can't visit him, but he must know something. Here's his address. Okay, so we gotta complete these Why? to unlock the Plague Doctor costume. Home of the Infected Man, the former patient shop. So, let's make these our, like, priority. Um, hello? Ah, no, stop. Casebook, here we go. Hey, there we go. Um, field research, that's what it is. <laughs> Did you guys hear my dad sneeze? <laughs> okay, let's see. Dr. Grant asked me to visit a shop in Salvation Harbor on Windheim Street, south of Polaris Road. Men who died turned into a monstrous creature located in northern Salvation Harbor. So, they're both in Salvation Harbor. Um. Okay, we'll, we'll do this one. I want to... Pin evidence? Oh, place on map. Here we go. Dr. Grant asked me to visit a shop, Central Salvation Harbor, Windtime Street, and south of Polaris Road. Salvation Harbor, Windtime Street, and Polaris Road. Polaris. 
Air, Polaris, here it is. And then Windine, right? So like right here? Right here? Okay. How far is that? Oh dang, that's really far. <laughs> I guess we could fast travel here. And then we can just like go down there. Okay guys, wish me luck. I don't know how this is gonna go. We gotta go travel. <laughs> Did you guys hear him? <laughs> yeah, that was my dad. <laughs> We're over at his house. He's on vacation. It's like 30 degrees here in Oklahoma. All right, so let's go fast travel. Hopefully we can find like a fast travel place like near there, you know? Oh, baby. Is this game spooky? It is. It's very spooky. It's, uh... Yeah. I mean, it's not like a jump scare spooky game. It's like survival horror spooky. You know? <laughs> I'm getting cold. I'm gonna turn my heater. Hopefully it doesn't, like, burn me. Because I have, like, a, a heater that, that's, like, right here next to me. Okay. So we gotta go, where's the key on my compass? Okay, so we gotta take a left over here and pretty much go all the way down. Let's go. So we can actually fall off the boat if we're not careful, it's happened. And we can die. <laughs> we can die. I don't know why I'm smiling. Red Keeman, hi. All right, so we can definitely go straight, I guess, when we go down here. I hope I'm going the right way. I don't wanna take the wrong straight down. All right, I think it's this way. Pretty positive. Right? Right? Yeah, that should be it. That should be Gucci. All right, all right. Booyah. Booyah, baby. Oh yeah, people like will fight. It's like, Eagle stop it. Hey, I was just trying to break up the fight. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I didn't. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't mean to make you guys care. You guys were fighting. Don't tell the police, <laughs> please. If we find a checkpoint, where we're gonna have to go there. <laughs> Don't die, thank you. Hey, you guys better stop. Oh, look at that whale. I'm the authority here in town. You guys better comply. Okay, we gotta go straight. As long as it's not an infested area. Yeah, this game is... This is a good grindy game. If, if you're on vacation, if you have a lot of time on your hands, I mean, like, this is a really interesting game to get into. Boop, boop, boop. Infested area, please? You can find a lot of good, good stuff in, like, infested areas. Let's see if there's any, like, boxes that we can search and sue. Hey, you better stop. Oh, wait. Hey, what you better stop. <laughs> yes, right. How many points do you get for running people over? <laughs> I don't think you can do that with a boat. Like, I don't think people are in the water, because there's, I think there's, like, tentacles in the water, because it's, like, a Cthulhu game, and there's, like, a lot of squid and... Hey. What are you guys doing? What are you doing? You better stop. <laughs> All right. Um. So we gotta go right. All the news that's fit to print. Hey. Paper, Mister. I'll take a piece. He's mad. No, I'll take it. I just wanted. I was giving you my gun because I know you guys like bullets. All right. So we gotta go over here. I swear I'm not crazy. I swear. Hi! Don't, don't, don't do it, 
I'm not gonna do anything. I'm just trying to give you a high five, buddy. All right, so I think our place is over here somewhere. So we're looking for an H on the door. Hey! What do you think you're doing? Don't do it, sir. Deagle and Ting. I was helping you! <laughs> Don't do it, sir. I was just trying to help. All right, let me know if you guys, like, find an H on any of the doors. Okay, so that's an infested area over there. Go looking for an H. Tentacles in the Watsa? Yeah. You heard me right. There are tentacles in the Watsa. Um, where is this place? Let's look at the map. Central Salvation Harbor on Winheim Street, south of Polaris Road. Okay, so it has to be here. It has to be here somewhere. We're looking for an H. Oh, right there. Stop it. What did you just say to me? Dude, she doesn't even, she doesn't even care. <laughs> okay, that's good. Men's finest clothing. Okay, I think this is it. Um. I mean, this is the only H that we can find, so. Alright, let's go in. Former. Okay, yeah, we found it. We found it. Oh, God. <laughs> Nope. That's gonna be a big yikes for me. God, I really want the plague outfit. And the only way to get it is if we complete this, but... Do we want to die? You know what? Let's just go in. So, we just have to figure out what happened to the guy. Wish me luck, guys. Anyone in here? over there. Okay, okay. Let's try to make some stuff. The revolver, I think that's more powerful than, um, what should I call it, than this pistol. Then again, like, I like the shotgun shells a lot better. I can't wait till we... <laughs> Oh, no, 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 no. Oh! Ew! You nasty! You disgusting! You get out of here! You stay down! Ew! Why is it all black? I can't... Oh god! What? Why is it all black? Oh my god! The fuck? Is that like ink? Ah! <laughs> Set to what I want it to be. 
Yeah, it, it should be pretty damn. Come on. Come on! What the hell? What, how am I supposed to- Oh my god. <laughs> you wanna button go? Son? You wanna come at me? Yeah, nice. You wanna dance? Alright, I'll just investigate while that thing is... Those bloodstains would definitely attract wild beasts. You don't say. Seems after visiting Dr. Grant, the shop owner preferred to self-medicate. Why won't you die? Dude! You are actually so annoying. I am trying not to waste my bullets on you. Jesus Christ, okay. Reload that shit. Seems after visiting Dr. Grant, the shop owner preferred to self-medicate. All right, okay. GG's, guys, GG's. Is that another one? Come on. Are we really going into the basement? There's a dude dead right there. Okay, good. We got gunpowder. When do we get the shotgun? I, I, I want that shotgun. I don't think he's going to tell me much about those monsters. Okay, well, he's dead. Um... <gasps> what was that? Alright, well, it, it did lead me here. Can't bear to stay awake any longer. Can't let them take me there. Every time I see them in a dream, they appear near me, touching me with their cold hands. Dang, okay. Is there any more of those? Oh! You're lucky I don't have bombs in here. You're lucky that I don't have that shotgun that I unlock. Stop running! Yeah, I got you cornered! Damn it. I got one. Dude, it ran out. It ran out. <laughs> I'm trying to get all the experience I need to level up. Die! Oh my sweet baby Jesus. You are actually really annoying! Die, you fleshy thing! I got one! There's another one! Yeah, you're stuck, aren't you? I got you! God damn, okay. Wow, that was nasty. Johnny is here, hi Johnny. Okay, I can't level up yet. So, we already, we solved it. So now we have to Home of the Infected Man, former patient shop. So now we have to go to this one. Because I think we solved this one already. I'm pretty sure we solved this case already. Um, is there like an upstairs? Or is it just the downstairs? Alright, yeah, we sh should be good. Alright, well let's- I think we're done here. Let's take this off of our map, and then we have to go to another one, and then we should be done with uh, the hospital quests. We are playing the Sinking City. The man who died and turned into a monstrous creature 
lived in Northern Salvation Harbor on Moreland Road between Higgs Lane and Benevolent Tides. Okay, so Moreland, Higgs, and Benevolent. Moreland. Okay, Moreland, Moreland, Moreland. Here it is, Moreland. And... Salvation Arbor. I mean, Moreland is right here. Higgs Lane and Benevolence. Higgs Lane. Where the heck is that? It, it's up here somewhere. Oh, here it is. Here is Benevolence? But where's Higgs? Orchard. Ah, that's benevolent. Right? Oh, here it is. Higgs. Benevolence. So it's right here. Between the Higgs Lane and Benevolence. So it's in the middle of the water? Okay. Well, let's go. Get those nasty fleshy things. Oh yeah. That's what, you know, when you give birth, why is it so dark? Oh, night time. <laughs> you know, when you give birth, when a woman is in labor, that's what the placenta looks like. I kid you not. Should we save? We should probably save. What if I die? <laughs> Moreland and Harbor, yeah. I'm happy that it kind of, like, shows the hints. Can I fast travel there? Is it close to, like, any of the- Oh! I can just fast travel to this point. Yeah, and then I could just take a boat. Take a butt. Hi, Brett. <laughs> Alright. Wish me luck, guys. Yeah, this should be it. I think after this next mission, we should be, uh, we should be unlocking our- Skin. Plague Doctor skin. Wow, the baby sack? Yeah, the placenta. You know. That thing that is in the womb. Belevolence. Higgs and Belevolence. I, I already marked it on the map. I think I marked it correctly. I don't know. Ooh, this heater feels good. I would pick it up and show you guys, but I don't want to burn myself. I don't want to do that. Oh. Mm. This is nice. This is very nice. <laughs> Maybe, can I like, I'm gonna put the mic right here so I can just like sit back and relax. Oh baby. Alright. Okay, so let's see. Where is, okay, we gotta go over here. It's pretty dark, I can't really see anything, to be honest. Can you guys see anything? <clears throat> okay, so we gotta go left. We gotta go left and stay left. Can I even, like, I can't see shit. I don't know if you guys can. I think it might be my TV, to be honest. Okay, guys, wish me luck. Oh shit, do I go that way? Do I go? No, okay. Just keep going straight. I'm scared that something is gonna get me in the water. Oh no. I sound like Kelly because I'm whispering. Guys, I feel good. Oh my god. Oh shit! Oh my god! <laughs> hey! You better pay for that, chum. Alright. We're getting there. Just follow the map. I wish I had, like, big lights, you know? 
Well, it, it's in the water, apparently. I can't really use my, my like, sixth sense thing. Um, right now. Actually. It has to be one of these places over here. There's a dock right there. Let's see where we're at. Let's see. This might be it. I mean, this is the only place, like, between those two streets on the actual street. This has to be it. I really hope nothing scary happens because I'm, uh, I'm so relaxed right now. Oh, we should probably use this. Oh, there's blood. Oh no, and there's like, toys. No. 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 We're not going in there. We're not going there. But I do need that Plague Doctor costume, so maybe we should just go in there, no balls? Fine, fine. Just have our gun ready. I only have four bullets in there anyway. Damn it. You sure the strength thing? Keep Brett. Alright, guys. Wish me luck. Should I? You know what? Let's just go in here. No balls. Fuck. Oh, come, come. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> this is creepy. <laughs> you wanna come after me, boy? <laughs> I saw you peeking. <laughs> I saw him peek. He was like, alright. Okay, let me sit up for this. Oh god, I think I see him too. I think he's like in the darkness. Alright. <laughs> oh god. Alright, let's go. a little bit scared. I might be just a ton bit scared. Just a little bit. Just a tiny. Okay, he dead. Wasting my bullets. Eat chicken. <laughs> I mean, it's a, it is creepy. This isn't a comedy, even though I am smiling. <laughs> it like came out of the water. There's blood. There's blood everywhere. Every kid's childhood dream. I wanted a toy like that too once. Going crazy. <laughs> oh shit. Okay, let's hope that we don't get any more crazier than that. Bad dreams again? The thing under the floor keeps scratching. I told mom, but she said it was rats. Do they not realize that they live on top of a river? <laughs> How can there be rats, mom? <laughs> Dad told off John for playing with slimes near the hole, but it wasn't him. 
I told Dad about the thing who lives in the basement, and he punished me too. I tonight saw the head looking from the hole and cried. Comes at night and wants to do bad things to me and John. Why do Mom and Dad? Why don't Mom and Dad believe me? Oh. So, I have a feeling, I think we came to the conclusion the last time we played this game that, like, the family turned into... What is that? I heard whispering. The family turned into, like, those monsters. I heard the whispering. In here? Okay. There's like a door right there. I think we're, we're probably gonna have to go in there. In all honesty. Um, let's go upstairs. Let's see if we can find anything upstairs. Uh, first, let's make some bullets. Oops. Oh, we should be good. Do we have to reload our gun? No? Okay, good. Yeah, it looks like there's a basement here, so... We'll go check that out in just a second. Nervous smile, you got him, Rob. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm, I'm definitely... I'm definitely one of those people who smiles a lot. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Oh, shit, I'm about to die! Run! Oh my god! <laughs> oh, Mama Sita, I'm about to die! Alright. Um, how do I use that? Oh. None. There we go. Alright, I should probably make some more of that stuff. <laughs> Maybe. Shit. I don't have any alcohol. Oh my god. Dude, they're all- do I have any bombs? I don't have any bombs. How am I gonna do this? If they all come out, I'm dead. Because <laughs> I only have one- I only have one thing about left. But I have to do this. I actually ha I got it. Oh, fuck. You six sons of bitches! Oh no! Get in the boat! Get in the boat! Oh god! <laughs> Get out of there! <laughs> Jesus Christ! How do I get out? How do I get off of this thing? Oh my god! <laughs> I can't make any more heals! What am I- Okay, this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna save, and we're just gonna go in there. I mean, we can honestly just... load back in, if we die. Holy shit! I was outnumbered! Alright guys! Should we just do it? Can I level up? <clears throat> if I level up, then I can actually, um, like, do my health. When close to death, slowly return a limited amount of health for one last fighting. Exactly. I think I need to get that. I didn't realize how hard this was going to be. You know? Oh my god. You know what? I did save. I did save. We can go in there. Shit. They're all upstairs. They all gotta be upstairs. see him. Damn it, we gotta, <laughs> we gotta investigate, but we can if we're, like, outnumbered. You know? 
shit. If I had a bomb, I would be able to just, like, blow him up, you know? I think I managed to go through this uh, with a shotgun, but you don't get the shotgun until later. You gotta get more from some place. I can get more from, like, infested areas. Is there anyone... There's an infested area down here, but it's really hard to go through those because there's a lot of monsters, you know? Um, really hard monsters. And I, I only have a pistol and a revolver. I could try the revolver out and see if that actually does help. So we can see if this actually works. Like if this is a lot stronger than the pistol. I think the revolver is actually more strong, stronger than the uh, the pistol. So let's see. Where are they? They shoot stuff at you, which makes it really hard to like defend yourself. I'm not far in the game, I'm still in the beginning. Oh shit, yeah, they're right there. Uh oh. Okay. Oh fuck, I missed! Got one? Got another one? I thought there was another one. This revolver is is like the holy grail. Fuck you. Fuck you though. All right. Oh God, I was about to forget. I thought there were three of them. I this thought there were three. still looks fresh. I suspect Dr. Grant would be interested in it. just like ran out of here through this little like hole in the ground and then there was uh the basement uh, too weeks have passed since this food was cooked uh-huh okay so we can kind of figure out what's going on there we go <laughs> miss john you How bad I feel. I have to go to work. Oh. Why can't you understand that? Oh. Did I feel you? I feel you. Okay, we gotta go downstairs. I hope that one slimy thing isn't down here. I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be bad. Time to figure this out. Okay, we'll do this one first. So we gotta put this in the correct order. See what happened. And then the next one would probably be this one. No matter how bad I feel, I have to go to work. And then why the can't you understand that? Is this when they're turning into the monsters? I feel bad. I think I killed the family, but they were monsters, you know. This, <laughs> John. Did we do it right? Oh yeah, she, yes, we did it. from the sunken basement at night and infected the family. After a short incubation period, they turned into monsters too. That's crazy, damn. Here, let's make more bullets. Man, that sucks! The whole family, man! The whole family turned into monsters. So I guess, like, it's like these monsters can turn other people into them. Um, geez, I, I kind of feel a little bit guilty. What is that? That gun really came in handy. Yeah, th this revolver is amazing. <laughs> but I need a shotgun. 
I feel like the shotgun would actually do better. So we can go investigate here. What is this? Gunpowder. Okay. Oh, what the hell? Shell casings. Gunpowder. Okay. Oh, I thought we could go into the basement. All right. Well, I think we're done here. So we have to go back to the hospital and report what we have found to the doctor. Let's see. So the map. Um, okay, let's get this off. So we have to go to a, a let's see, like a checkpoint. I guess we could go to that one over there. Man, that sucks. Oh, there's a checkpoint over here somewhere. Sweet. We're like next to the fish market. Have you ever been to a firing range in real life? Yeah. I have. I used to go when I was like in high school, I guess, a long time ago. Um, all right, let's go fast travel to the hospital and get our Plague Doctor costume. <laughs> yeah. It would be a cool vlog. Uh, no, I don't really want to put any, like, real gun stuff on my channel, to be honest. Um, yeah. Because, like, I don't know who's watching me. I don't know if there's kids, and I don't want kids to be watching me if I'm going to the gun range, to be honest. So, yeah. But I don't really go shooting anymore. I used to because my dad's into it. What's up? The Great One. Clever spelling. Alright. Let's go over here. Uh, yeah. I think it's over here. Should be over here. All right, doctor. I need my plague doctor costume, please. I want it. Hi. Uh, I went I to his house. I checked the house of the diseased man, Bells. His family has turned into those creatures too. Huh. Fascinating. Did you discover the source of the contamination? A creature emerged from their sunken basement and transformed them. I think its vomit is contagious. Hmm. If so, we must quarantine it. Those Lethian revenants are a huge threat. This city could not survive an epidemic like that. Hmm. What did you call them? Uh, Lethian revenants. Oh, you may thank the university professor for the beast's unwieldy names. Hmm. You have a pillow to support your back? Not really. Why? Wait, what about the, uh... Be safe. We don't have any free beds left. <laughs> Wait, is that it? Is that all is that all we did? Huh? Dr. Grant asked me to visit a shop and I did! Do I Oh we haven't finished that one. Oh crap. Even before the flood man owned it, it was haunted by monsters in his dreams. But we found him dead! Be safe. We don't have Hold on, let's look at the map. The map would actually tell us if we missed anything. Oh, we didn't complete that. Okay, so we have to go back. We have to go back to the first place that we went to. Um, I thought we got everything. We must have missed something. So, damn it. <laughs> I thought we were done with that. I should have double checked, darn it. Um, no, I don't- I don't have a pillow for my back. I mean, it would be great to get, um, a better chair, <laughs> you know, but it's okay. Maybe for Christmas, you know, I'll probably get myself a present, <laughs> you know? I might get something from, like, Office Depot, because, like, they're starting to add some gaming chairs, like, at the Office Depot where I live. I'm like, dang, they're bumping it up. Check if there's something else you probably- yeah, I think I did miss something, so, um, 
Yeah, we gotta go back. Hopefully we don't get attacked by those placentas, tentacle things, you know, those nasties. All right, so we gotta go, let's see. We gotta go this way? Yeah, okay. I'm surprised. I thought we looked everywhere, but I guess, I guess there's something that we missed. I mean, we found the body and everything, um, and like a suicide note. And I wonder if maybe we didn't collect it. But let's just go double check. Oh, can we? We could probably level up too. <laughs> yeah. A natural recovery when close to death. Yeah. So we're gonna. We're definitely gonna be doing that. Because these monsters are like crazy hard. Hey! Stop it! Okay, let's go. Let's change our guns for the pistols. Alright, what did we miss here? Oh, yeah, we didn't do the um, investigating. We didn't do any of the investigating. Oh, shit. Hi. Dude, these ones are fucking annoying. I just hate the fucking, like, black ink that they spit. You know? Shit's annoying. Die, damn it! I'm playing on easy, like, ah! <laughs> Jesus Christ. Okay, so what Seems the hell? Seems after visiting Dr. Grant, the sh those blood stains would definitely have... Is that what we didn't find? The dreams returned again, even stronger than before. I feel those things touching me, crawling, leaning towards my warmth. The doctor is being obsessed with his theories, but who can help me? I'm losing my mind. Today I woke up, and one of the creatures was under my blanket. I smashed on the floor and stomped it until it stopped moving. Neither coffee nor cocaine. Cocaine? Oh my god. Work to stay awake. K, help me. Attract wild beasts. Key evidence collected. Did we... Okay, so there's more to kind of like look around. Um, here in the shop. Gunpowder. I mean, we did go downstairs, that's the thing. Okay, so let's go down- let's go back downstairs, there's probably something we missed. You guys are annoying! How am I supposed to play this game if I- the hell? Back over here. Am I like losing my mind being down here? Wow, that thing is actually really dumb. Oh, there's like things down here. Oh, I am losing my mind. Oh, crap. Okay. Oh! Oh, shit. Okay. Um. All right. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. What is happening? There's still stuff that we haven't. Do you want to die? I am not wasting my bullets on these guys. <laughs> yeah, that's where I die. Wow, I cannot see anything here. Oh my god. Oh my god. Die, damn it! It's like trying to get a fly. Okay, you really want to do this? You want to play this game? We could play. Damn it! 
You're so annoying! Holy shit! Give me that experience point! Oh my god, you're so... <laughs> Get, something up. Get over here, damn it! Holy crap. You stupid tentacle thing. Alright, let's go down here. We're missing something. I don't know what it is we're missing, but we are definitely missing something. We took his note. What the hell was that? Oh my god. Look around some more. I don't think there's an upstairs. Like, we already checked him out. I don't out. think he's going to tell me much about those monsters. Hang on, what if we... I don't think he's going to tell me much about those monsters. Okay, so that didn't do anything. Um, what the hell are we missing? We're missing something. We're losing our sanity in here too. That's a lot of monsters. key evidence. I mean, I, I guess... Oh, wait. I didn't even, I didn't even see this. <laughs> okay, we got all of the evidence collected. Interesting. So, uh, the doctor kind of told him he had, like, a parasite in his body. Okay, well, let's go fast travel. I know, I... How did I not see that? Well, at least we got it. That's good. I want to get everything that I can with these missions, because what if it changes the story? What time is it? 1.27? It is, okay. 1.27. All right. So we'll go fast travel and then I think we will have our Plague Doctor costume. Which is my favorite skin in the game. Ah, oh, nice. Oh my goodness. Hi guys, how's it going? I'm getting a little bit hungry right now. Oh, I don't know what to eat for lunch. What should I get? Should I get like fries? Soup? Sushi? No, sushi is like too expensive. It's like $13 a roll for my favorite sushi restaurant. Okay. So we gotta go to the hospital. Let's go. Would you guys live here? Yeah? Okay, we should be... We should be pretty good. Pretty Gucci. Pig feet? <laughs> Ew. I've never had pig feet before. I visited the patient with I weird dreams. The shop of your patient. Unfortunately, he committed suicide. Oh, I wish I could say I was surprised. Sorry for wasting your time. Uh, it wasn't entirely a waste. I found some evidence that sheds mm. light on the origin of those creatures. Uh, for what it's worth, Professor Westerbrook calls them <clears throat> Stygian harvesters. But uh, what is it you found? Your patient's diary. His dreams became too too confronting. He tried to stay awake using stimulants, but mm. those Stygians appeared near him when he slept, as if they were leaking from his nightmares. Hmm. A psychic phenomenon? Or manifestation? How unnerving. I'm afraid he's mm -hmm. not the only one suffering from such dreams. 
Hmm. More creatures to investigate? Your studies rather interesting, Dr. Grant. You have more places to search? What dedication. Thank you. Your findings have been a rich resource. No, I want the costume, course. damn it. I've got two more places for you. Ah, crap. More dangerous, one with huge monstrosities, but I'll prepare a comparable reward. Oh, no. Come on. <laughs> huge? Tell me more. Ah, come on. I thought we were going to be done. <laughs> we got two more. Okay. Tell me more. What am I getting myself into? One of Oakmont's largest stores was closed after the flood hit. A looter tried to break in, but his thievery was, shall we say, interrupted. He was set upon by a huge wild beast and hardly made it out. The question is, with the building locked up tight, how did that creature get in? Okay. What about the place with more manageable creatures? Well, there's a restaurant here with a bad reputation, and not for its food. Oh, the restaurant. Oh, God. The police found nothing. I treated the partner of one missing girl. He arrived here severely injured and told me about the jumping maws. He was at the restaurant, too, I suppose. Indeed. And what's curious is the place is still open. Please investigate and find out how that's possible. Okay. So we got we got two more and then we should be done. Um Can we level up? Crap. I really need to level up my inventory. Um let's see. Like carry more stuff. I think it's this one right here. Carry up to 25 pieces. I need that <laughs> so I can carry more. Um, let's see if we can craft any stuff. God, I wish I had a shotgun. Because that stuff actually, the shotgun does help with, like, the bigger monsters and, uh, molotovs. I think molotovs. Um, okay, yeah, first aid. How do we get those, though? I don't know how we get those. Okay, well, let's go. I should probably shave it. Should we do the big monster one first? <laughs> Just so we could get it out over with? <laughs> oh my god. Okay, let's do it. We're gonna do the big monster first. Oh god. Okay, let's check out our case book. So, actually, they're all kind of like pretty hard. They're all pretty hard, but it's worth it. <laughs> it's totally worth it. Um, so we need to go to Reed Heights. It's a shop on Ward Street between Bourbon Road and Sam. Okay. Western Reed Heights. Where the hell is that? Oh, shit. Here we go. On Ward Street between Bourbon and Sam. Okay, so here's Bourbon, and then there's Sam. Ward Street? Right here, okay. All right. Let's see, can we fast travel over there? Um... through we could go through this area and try to unlock some places over there all right well, let's go do this area so we can like see everything we can go left okay hi everybody i wish i could jump 
Oh god, is that an infested area over there? Is it? <laughs> How do we get over there? How do we get over there? They're, they're kind of like in my position too. Um... Hey, Excuse me. Alright, that doesn't do anything. I'm just trying to help, okay? okay. I guess we could go over here. You need to let loose. That's right. Grubs, check your PayPal when you get a chance. My PayPal? Okay. Find something you like. I will than the rest. Definitely check it out. Okay, I'm just gonna check this stuff out. Okay, Mike, I will. I will in just a little bit. Um let me just try to find a way over here. Let's see. I'm trying, whoops. I'm trying to get over here, but it's like, oh, is this an infested area? Ah, shit. I don't want to go over there. I mean, there's a boat. Literally, we could just go to the boat. It should just be like right there. Oh my god. How do we, how do we jump? Yeah, this place doesn't look... Should we just run? Oh, that's so scary. Okay. Um... Okay, we could go over here, and then we could go through Advent, and then over there. So we're, we're, we're not fast traveling now because we're trying to find, like, checkpoints. So we can get around easier. <laughs> Cause this map is huge. This map is really big. Which I gotta appreciate the big map, to be honest. Ooh. Is there any thing I can loot over here? No? Okay. Let's go check out this checkpoint really quick. I think it's over here. Did we... Is this a checkpoint we already, like, have? Hello? Ah, come on! Really? It is a checkpoint that we already checked out. Damn it! It's our hotel. Ah. Okay, fine. Fine. All right, we can go down this river, and then, well, there should be, no, we can go down this river, actually. And then, go over here. We're going the right way right now. Yeah, we'll just keep going over here. I don't want to tip over my boat. <laughs> I don't want to die. What was that? Oh god, that was probably like another boat. Okay, we're looking for another checkpoint around here. Huh, there's like stuff right there. Hang on, can I actually like make stuff right now? 
Oh, Daniel, thank you. <gasps> Wickety is here. How are you? I'm good. I'm just playing my game. Um, we're gonna, let's see. We're gonna save our inventory stuff. Okay, no, we can't level up. Yeah, I'm doing really good. I'm really happy that we're playing this game because this is a game that I was really into in the summer and I lost all of the progress for it, so, um, you know, I never really started back up because it's a pretty long game, <laughs> you know? And best area, hell no, hell no, we're not going there. <laughs> we're not going there. That place is scary. Invested areas are a big no-no. Oh my god. Okay, um, let's see. Okay, we can go straight and then find a checkpoint over here. Terrigrant, hi! Hi guys! How's everybody doing? I'm just, uh, just chilling in this game. It's a pretty, it's a scary game, with an interesting story. Happy to see you all, aww. No, I'm happy that, uh, that I'm finally back, because last week has been kind of like crazy for me. Okay, we found a fast travel point, thank god. <laughs> um, yeah, no, last week has been kind of crazy for me, because I had like three doctor's appointments, and I have another one in two weeks because, um, when I went on Thursday, it was just like a consultation, I guess, just to see like what's going on and if everything was okay. And then um, the day that I was like supposed to talk with the doctor and like get some information about like how to like, you know, get better because like I was going through some stuff. Uh, he had to leave because like his dad passed away and I felt so bad like I couldn't get mad. So I had to reschedule for Sunday and then I was actually shocked that they were open on Sunday, to be honest, because that's like, you know, it's on the weekend. Um, but yeah, no, I had to go last Sunday, so like a couple days ago. Like two days ago? Three days ago? And then, yeah, I finally, I got some medicine, I, I feel really good. Two weeks I have a checkup, so everything should be fine. It's just like women's health, guys, you know? It's kind of embarrassing to say. Um, but yeah, no, it was a busy week. Very busy week. I'm seeing if there's like another checkpoint anywhere. I'm gonna go check over here. You had to reset your PS4 to fix the game and you lost your- Oh no! Did you really- Really? I wonder, isn't there a way to get back your safe- Like, your, your data? Because I think like- there probably is a way to get my save data back from this game, but like, I just, I'm too lazy to do it. <laughs> Mike, um... But yeah, I mean, that sucks, that's sorry. Alright. I was expecting to find like another checkpoint over here, cause like, this place is huge. You know? But I guess not. Which is alright. Okay, so... I have to go all the way over there. Um, over here. Yeah, I think uh, I think I was playing. Was I playing on my brother's PS4? No, I was playing on this PlayStation, I think. Or was it my sister's? I don't remember why. Like I lost my like data and everything. They can fight back. <laughs> what? <laughs> Is there really not a checkpoint over here? Hey, he was kicking a car. I was just trying to stop him. Jesus. Alright. 
How is there no checkpoint over here? We're like in a whole new area. Oh my god. Okay. What the heck? Like, how come there's no checkpoint here? Well, we're supposed to find, like, a big monster. A big monster for, like, in this house, so I'm really scared that we're gonna die. I have a feeling we're gonna die, to be honest. Oh, here we go. Alright, so we're looking for a door with an H. Okay, I think we found it. Alright, so there should be a big monster in here, so we gotta be... We gotta be super careful. Um... So we're just supposed to investigate, pretty much, and... <laughs> I don't want to do it, man. Did you guys hear that? Did you hear that? As soon as I opened the door, <laughs> Sharks said hi! Oh my god. It's... <gasps> Okay, that's in the game. I was like, is that storming outside my house? Holy shit. Oh, I thought she was gonna walk in there. I was like... <laughs> Hang on, there should be... Come over here! I love that nobody is, like, kind of freaking out about this. You know, I've only killed that thing with, uh... <laughs> with, uh, Molotovs. And I don't think I have any Molotovs. <laughs> Kill it in the house! Do you know- I don't have anything. I don't- oh my god. That thing will- okay, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna save? Cause that thing can EAT ME! <laughs> oh my god, okay. Yeah, no one is like taking notice that there's a big boy. I think we're wasting bullets. Uh, which one? I think that's the one that I just saved. I think. <laughs> is this game the Sinking City? It is. They should rename it to the Sinking Monsters because I don't know what the hell is going on. <laughs> that glitch, though. It should have, like, run back into the house instead of, like, sinking into the ground like that. Huh. Okay, we could go in there and try to fight it. It's just that I don't think... I don't think we're gonna be... good. <laughs> I don't think we have good weapons to fight it. We're gonna die. Do you have Call of Duty? 
I don't play Call of Duty. I'm really bad at it. I have I have one of the Call of Duty games. I don't I forgot which one it was. Um But yeah, I only play it for the zombies, to be honest. Um, but yeah. I should call it glitching monsters. This game is full of glitches, which it doesn't like make me think less of this game. Alright, are we anywhere near it? Okay, yeah, we are we are like next to it, so Oh shit. Okay. We need to make Oh my god, we only have six bullets. Shit. Okay. Reload. Whoops. Sorry, guy, my dude. And we don't have any traps, too, so it's like, we're gonna have to run. Oh my god, okay. Well, it's over here. This is the spot. I don't know how. go in there. I want to have a cop with me. I want a cop with me. I think we'll have two guns, two people. Oh my god! Ah! I can't! How do you get traps? Guys, how do you get traps in this game? Do you just have to... Should I come back when I have traps? I don't know what to do. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Big boy's back. Hi. Get away, get away, get away, get away, get away. <laughs> okay, we're not doing this. I think... I'm gonna come back when I have some Molotovs, because at least I'll be able to actually kill it. So, um, we're just gonna go ahead and do, uh, what do you call it, the main mission. Northern Coverside at the crossroad of Asher Road and Hubert's. Cover side, crossroad of Asher and Hebrew. I think that's over here. Cover side. Yeah, right there. So, we need to find a fast travel point, which I don't know where one is, where we're at. Oh, there's one right down the road. Okay, cool. Yeah, we're not going back. We're gonna, we're gonna go back when we have enough weapons to kill it, because I don't want to... We're definitely not prepared for that. <laughs> that thing is gonna eat us. Um, okay, let's see. So we gotta go pretty much right here. And go towards the key on the map. So I think Clearly, the more we progress, the more weapons that we unlock, so we're gonna wait until we have, like, Molotovs and traps. Because at least, like, when it's trapped, like, it gives us a chance to run <laughs> if we have to run. Although it's a pretty slow monster. Um, yeah. So we're gonna- we're gonna do some of the main quests to get ready. Hopefully get some better weapons, you know? Alright, so let's go over here. We have to go over here? Yeah. Did I really have to take a boat <laughs> over there? need to level up though like in all honesty to have more like uh what do you call it items to make 
Let's see. So it should be over here. Yeah. Okay, I think this is it. Because it has an H on it. I think. Oh, we have to investigate what happened here. Oh, snap. Okay. Guess I don't need the key. <laughs> I don't say. Uh oh. You guys hear that? Uh, divers with the bends can suffer from numerous symptoms, including pain, impaired movement, nausea, vomiting, and disorientation. Oh, okay. Dangers of diving. Someone smashed it beyond repair. Okay. So we just have to... Are a few damp papers all that's left of the expedition? Oh. Oh. Okay. Make sure we have our gun. Is it going upstairs? Why is it so quiet? <laughs> Mike. Eels? Dude, those are eels. Um. Okay. We're getting shell casings. Can't say I ever saw Good. another shell like it. Okay. How to protect a coronary data of the places with paranormal activity have a strong previous identified influence on the human minds. We have prepared a list of solutions, including meditative practices and supplies of sedatives to prevent cases of madness among the expedition members. I highly recommend discarding all those charms, amulets, and religious symbols, which are no use. Applying these scientifically valid methods to professions. Dead. Okay. Interesting. That's nasty. Did I not get anything in there? Um, okay. Fisherman reports. Local fishermen report numerous large bubbles, unbearable stench rising from the bottom of the sea. Bought a sample of a weird substance floating in the ocean from whoever. He found it among numerous dead and strangely deformed fish. I'm taking for analysis. Um... A rock that rose from the seabed, making the fog shine in different colors. The witnesses felt sick from and dizzy for two or three days after the incident. He got severe burns after chiseling off a part of the rock in his basement. What, this? This thing? These samples glitter in a weird way. Oh, Charlie! From. Charlie! Thank you for the pounds. Oh my god. <laughs> Ooh, how are you doing, Charlie? Nice gameplay. Thank you. I'm definitely paying more attention to uh, everything since my last gameplay. Okay. What am I looking for? Okay, let's go down here. Okay, guys, let's see this again. <clears throat> Is there a basement here? Oh! How are we getting insane? A secret door? How do they do that? I kind of know. Oh, 
following must be the following must be delivered okay no later than friday Hear that? This helmet's beyond. Oh repair. my god. Oh, Charlie, I'm good. Could I get mod watched you for ages now? Charlie. Charlie. <laughs> Charlie. Listen, thank you. Thank you for the, the super chat. Um, <laughs> you know, usually, usually I would like direct people who ask for mod to a video that my friend made. I think mods in chat know exactly what video I'm talking about. It's pretty much how to get mod on your favorite YouTube channel, right? What is that sound? What is that sound? Do you guys hear that? Oh. I don't know. Um, Charlie, uh, oh, it's this thing. I'll think about it. I don't see you active in chat. No offense, it's just that I, I'm not gonna give mod to anybody, even if you ask, if you donate, it's just a rule of mine. Um, no disrespect to you, it's just how it is. Um. We don't have time to pick it. Stand back. Okay. Grab the papers. Smash the rest. Alright. And then, do we have to go upstairs? No. I fatal me a fee I regach I a Dagon. Dagon? That's like a oblivion god. Burn it all. Make sure you get the adverts. Time to figure this out. Okay. This is the first one. We don't have time to pick it. Second. Stand back. Grab the papers. Smash the rest. Third. I fatal. Fourth. May I fail. Or. Burn it all. Make sure you get the adverts. Oh Several yeah, that's men okay. Broke into Yay. The headquarters. What they didn't smash, they burned. The archives, even the newspapers. New Mine Palace, Clue, Mine Palace, the Pillage Headquarters. I watched you since you played GTA 5 and told you to make a blog. Can you remember House Kelly? Well, you know, I appreciate that. That's the thing. It's like a lot of people watch me for a while, but. Charlie, I haven't seen you in chat, <laughs> you know? That's the thing. I haven't seen you in chat, you're not really active, so it's not like I I haven't noticed you really much in chat, you know? Hey, James. Uh, but Kelly's doing good. She just graduated from uh, her university, actually, this year. Uh, okay, Mind Palace. Okay. Man, I can't believe we almost got killed. So what do we have to do now? Um So we have to go to this location. Oh, here it is the expedition 
archive is lost, but I still have clues to follow up on. They left the city on a freighter from Grimhaven Bay. There might be recent postings or ads about the freighter in the Oakmont Chronicle. Okay, so we have to go to the newspaper place and pretty much do some research. This is something I really like doing in this game is like uh, the research part. Trying to like put all the pieces together and like finding out like where to go next. It's pretty, it's pretty fun. Will Kelly be streaming ever again and what you dressing as for Halloween? Kelly, uh, so she's gonna start her job. She just got a really good job actually um, as a video editor, part time right now. But wait, is there a checkpoint up here? What? Map, load up. Oh, cool. I think there is a checkpoint up here. Um, so she's been busy and she's actually gonna start full time in January. Sweet. All right, where is the newspaper place? Over here. So I think she will. I don't think she's doing it as much as she has been because of her job. When she went to school, she wasn't working. She was actually a full time student. So she had more time to stream, but like now that she's working she's kind of busy so i don't know i've asked her and she said well i'm busy so yeah i don't know she might she wants to actually what she said is that she actually wants to start vlogging um believe it or not so she's not going to be streaming she will be vlogging since she's an editor an editor where the heck is this newspaper place It's on the other side. How did we miss it? What? <clears throat> oh, uh, yeah, about my Halloween costume. I wanted to be like a plague doctor for Halloween, but um, I haven't gotten my costume because I've been like going to like the doctor's office a lot this week. So, is this it? Oh, this is it. Okay. Nice. You're gonna be the scream guy? Nice. The old papers are by the door. Take them and stop bothering me already. I think <clears throat> you've got me confused with someone else. Aren't you a newcomer? What's that got to do with Help it? Help me out here. What's the connection between newcomers and old newspapers? It's cold sleeping in the street and they come to collect the old newspapers for warm. I only got in recently. Yeah. I guess I am a newcomer. Charles Reed, private investigator. And I also need your old newspapers, uh, the archive, to be exact. Happy Halloween, oh. early that is. So, so oh, you're the you. one who cracked Happy the Albert Throgmorton you murder case. It's in a couple more days. I'm Helen. You know, it's supposed to snow say, on Halloween can you do me over favor? here, possibly. Give me an exclusive interview. I you hope it doesn't. Regret it. The Oakmont Chronicle is the best newspaper for miles around. Okay. It's a little right, chilly. Uh, Today is freezing where I live. Okay. Wait, interview? I don't want an interview. Yeah. See you later. <laughs> okay. Um here we go. Okay, so we have to find this boat. Um oh crap. Okay, so I need to find this period is after the flood. After the flood. Um, advertisements. And it's Grimhaven Bay. All right, there we go. Yeah, it's hard to find Kelly's channel because there's a lot of channels with her name. And I don't know. I mean, like, I don't know why it's really hard to find her channel. Plus, she hasn't uploaded in a while. If you search, like, Fallout and Lady K, then you might, like, that's usually how I find her channel. Even though I'm, like, subscribed to her, it's, like, still hard to look her up. Dude, look at my hair. <laughs> oh, my God. It smells really good. Mmm. Smells super good. Okay. I 
need to straighten my hair. Oh, tomorrow your girl is straightening her hair. I need to get my glasses too out of my car. Um, okay, so let's see. 3010 ship Titania. Titania is currently available for hire. You'll find it fully equipped for transport. For the price of 70 bullets. Damn, 70 bullets? You have thick hair? Yeah, you're telling me. Those interested are urged to contact Captain Jeremiah Sanders for contracting details. You can be found at Pier 3, Oakmont Fort, Grimhaven Bay. Okay, so we have to go over Grimhaven Bay at Pier 3. Like, right... Uh, right over here, pretty much. Here we go. I hope we can fast travel over there. That'd be great. I have thick hair too, yeah. <laughs> so you can relate. You two have the lion's mane. The all natural lion's mane. You're one of us. Part lion, part human. Alright. Oh, it's Charlie! Charlie, thank you! Oh my god. I'm surprised that you know my sister, Charlie. Not gonna lie. Like you remembered her. How is there not a checkpoint over here? What the heck? Um, okay. I guess we can... I guess we don't have to fast travel over there. We could just, like, head over there. Thank you, Charlie, for the super chat. Alright. Let's see. So what time is it for you guys? Cause for me it's um, it's two o'clock, two in the afternoon, and I'm hungry. And I'm thinking about you know once I end my stream, I'm thinking about getting food, but I cannot decide. Someone said pig's feet earlier, which I do not want to get at all. <laughs> What am I doing? Why am I... Oh! What the hell? Hey! Delete! Oh, wait a second. We haven't collected all the evidence. We collected the key evidence, which is like, to, you know, the evidence to progress. But we haven't collected everything. What the heck did we miss? Did we miss something down here? <gasps> oh. There's one more thing that we missed in here that we have to look for. Guess this helmet's beyond repair. Mm -hmm. Tacos? That sounds good. I killed a guy right there. I don't know where he was hiding, to be honest. Let's see, is there anything that I'm missing here? I'm definitely missing something. Like one more piece of evidence. I just don't know where where it could be at this like piece of evidence thing. <clears throat> I'm so confused. We already checked that out. Um, it's probably upstairs. Let's go check upstairs. I wonder if it's 
this. I guess you're that. Is it gonna open a fish tank? The heck? Kayla, welcome back. What the heck are we missing? <laughs> Can't say I we already ever saw looked another at this. show like it. Yeah, we already looked at this right here. And then... What? Alright. Something over here. Metal scrap. See like that right there. We're missing one thing, but I don't know what it is. These samples glitter in a <clears> weird <throat> way. I wonder where they came from. <laughs> Chat is dead. Bye. Have a great day. You don't have to be like that. Here we Out go. Of Cape Cod. It looks like there was something here, but it's been erased. Is that all evidence collected? Yes. Awesome. Okay. All right. So we have to go to the bar. I guess just keep going down this way. <laughs> Whatever you get for lunch reps, check your PayPal first. Oh yeah, Mike, I will. I will definitely check, thank you. Um, <laughs> thank you, I haven't even checked, but wow. Um, okay, yeah. I might honestly, I don't know if you guys ever heard of this place, but it's called like Freddy's Frozen Custard. It's a pretty good burger place. And they sell like ice cream, burgers, fries. I think they have like the best fries and burgers. It's pretty good, to be honest. Hi, Ruperto. Okay. Ooh, there's an infested area right there. So we have to go left? Okay. was that? Okay, so we just have to go straight. Oh, wait, no. We have to turn right. Up here. Okay, good. Good thing I looked at that. And then we gotta go left and then right. And then we're there. Hi, Borky. Left and right. Yeah, there's a couch right there. Dude, my hair is crazy. <clears throat> Ow. Is this the right way? <laughs> okay, good, yeah. And then all the way down. There should have been like a checkpoint over at this like bay place. <gasps> Angel, hi! Hiya, girl. What's up? Joe James, hello! Alright, we should be here. We should probably find like a checkpoint over here because this map is pretty big. Okay. Angel, how is everything? How are you doing? 
You look tense, honey. You need to let loose. Yeah? <laughs> okay. Oh, you just woke up? Really? Dang. Dang. Slept in, huh? Okay, so there is a checkpoint over here. Well, that's good. It's always good to sleep in. Yesterday, I was like... <laughs> God, yesterday was not a good day for me because, like, I, uh... Let's see, I had a doctor's appointment on Sunday, and then... Yesterday, I had some, like, prescription medication that I had to get to kind of, like, you know, help what's going on with me. Because last week, I was, like, going to, like, the doctor's office a bunch of times. And, uh, it was really... God, it was such a busy week. But, yeah, I mean, like, I was just, like, kind of out of it yesterday. I'm so happy I took the other last week off because, like, oh, my God. I was not feeling good last week. It was very good. So busy working because next month's going to be expensive. Oh my god. Yeah, it's going to be a pretty expensive month. It's my birthday next month and it's Black Friday. It's going to be my dad's birthday. It's going to be my brother's birthday. Like, everybody in my family was born in November. So, like, that time of year is always, like, birthdays. And then Thanksgiving. The hell? Oh. Thank you. At last. Hey, hey, help. Help. What's How you been feeling, Rebs? I've been features. feeling good. Today see is, like, today I feel really I good. I think everything These is, um, stand up to them. going back to normal. Wait. What are what, those creatures? What creatures? What are you talking about? But I've been feeling good. <laughs> Became the feast on the blood. So many birthdays going to... Oh, dead. really? Dang. I'm looking for Captain Sam. Yeah, everybody's birthday is in is November he in for me. Did the creatures get him? Uh, I saw Sanders. Right. Help me. I'm gonna I, move. I, I'll tell you what I know. Let's see. I'm gonna do this. Okay. So we gotta go kill the creatures for this dude over here. Had bit. There we go. Much better. Oh, wow. Uh, the harbor has been cleared. Is that it? Okay. Huh. Good night, refs. It's 3.30 in the morning. Dang. 3.30? Yeah, have a good night. Go to sleep. I've dealt with the creatures. Now, tell me about Sanders. He got back several hours ago. Those things, they came because of him. Okay, what kind of man is Sanders about Titania? Titania. What happened on the Titania? It was horrible. A damn massacre. Hella parents got busy shots. Valentine's Went month, out. that's why. <laughs> so the whole thing. Sailors bleeding. Seriously? Dying blood hit the water. That's then, November, babies. We know when the wild beast our parents the did the deed. <laughs> Let's see. What kind of man is Sanders? Where is he? I gotta he? find Sanders. Where is he? Saw him get away. Just after the shooting. Okay. Ran for the pier. Didn't see where he went after that. Did, uh... Did you see anyone else from the expedition? No. Only Sanders. I'd bet my life <laughs> no one else made it back. <laughs> you know what's sad? I've... <laughs> I've actually never had a valentine before. Never. Never in my days. Actually, maybe one time when I was a kid. Um, okay, we gotta investigate. Oh, honey. Oh, no. What happened? Ah. Uh, they emptied yeah. every chamber. Ah, uh, still sticks oh, no. of powder. No, it's true. I, I think I've had one, like, you know, during, like, the school Shut age. Dead. Point blank. Uh-oh. Oh, God. I think my guy is going crazy. Okay. 
But yeah, I mean, never been on a date on Valentine's Day. I've never received chocolates, unless if it was in class, <laughs> you know? Getting all the little candies for your classmates. Gotta be out of your head to do this to a man. Uh. Okay, we're... We're going crazy. We're going crazy. Oh my god. Okay, what is that, they were in high spirits. And plenty of them were drinking. You've never had a Valentine either? Mike! Mike, let's be Valentines. Will you be my Valentine, Mike? So we won't fall so we won't be lonely. <laughs> I will send you chocolates if you like chocolates. <laughs> um do we have to go in? Oh. This would be a weird artifact in any collection. I actually have like <laughs> I actually have like a figurine in my room that kinda looks like this. <laughs> Have you guys ever seen um, Pan's Labyrinth? Like that white man-eating monster or child-eating monster? I have him, I don't know, in my room. Cape Cod. The remarks here, but they've the been Valentine's? Erased. <laughs> Angel. Yes! It's one of my favorite movies! Ever since I was a kid. I, Captain Jeremiah Sanders, hereby agree to take on board my vessel, Titania? Can't even say that. Designated by Robert Throckmorton and the cargo detailed to attach manifest exploration. Oh, okay, so these are the people who went on the expedition. So we're missing, we're missing a clue. I think. Are we? I think we're missing a clue. What are we looking for now? Okay, we saw that. Oh, we didn't uh, even look at this. Monsters sure didn't leave behind much. Ugh. Okay, let's do this. Ah, you can't take me. Eat this. To the mare with you! Ugh. Die! Die! Alright. No more drink. All we've seen. And you telling me we ain't allowed rum. Let's get a handle on what actually happened here. Okay, I think this is what happened first. No more drink. And All we've seen. And, and you telling me we ain't allowed rum. To the mayor with you. Ugh. Die. Die. Ugh. You can't take me. I think. Eat this. For yes. whatever reason, the crew went berserk. Only one man. The hands have away. eyeballs. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Angel. That's the monster. Um, Caden. You know, believe it or not. Uh. Oh. Uh, believe it or not, Caden actually... Is my guy good? <laughs> oh my god. He actually loves that thing. <laughs> he calls him Milky. Alright. Wounded the sailor, burn the documents. Uh... Badly wound on the shoulder. Captain Sanders is, is the wounded man and now seeking medical aid. So we have to go to the hospital. Yeah, no, that's not gonna do anything. Okay. So I think we collected all the evidence over here. So now Let's remove this. How do we get rid of that? How do we... There we go. So now we have to go to the hospital. 
Caden does. My kids hated that monster when I had them watch it. Well, Caden's never, like, watched... You know, he's still really little. So, like, I'll tell him about it. Because, like, it is, like, super trendy. He goes to elementary school, so, like, kids talk about it. Um, so, like, I'll show him clips from the movie, but, like, I will not have him watch the movie until he's old enough. Because it's so... It's gruesome. It's graphic. I mean, it's cool. I don't think he is like me. Like, I don't think he likes... Actually, he he is kind of like me. He likes horror stuff. He's into Bendy. He's into like spooky kid games, I guess. <laughs> you know. But yeah, no, I'm definitely taking my time to like showing Caden like those movies because I don't want him to. I don't want him to you know be traumatized. I showed him a scene from It like two nights ago because like I was seeing if It too was on Amazon to rent because I still haven't seen it and. um... He was like, look, he was watching what I was like looking up on the TV and he was like, oh, I want to watch it. And I was like, no, you know, like, no, you're not going to watch it. And he was like, please. And I'm like, you're six. You can't watch it. And he was like, please. Like he was begging. And I'm like, okay, I'll show you a scene on YouTube. And I showed him the projector scene because like every other scene is pretty dang scary and that that was that was actually a scene that scared the crap out of me in theaters because that shit was big that, that was like a ginormous monster in theaters um i showed him it and like you know when it popped out of the projector screen with his teeth like he could not watch it and i was like i'm sorry like i was like kaden you wanted to see it now he's like i don't know if i want to see it yeah, Mr. Spot. Well, this is a test stream because, like, I. <laughs> I'm looking for a. I've got a trauma you. Okay. Let's see. Uh, sir, I really. Why? Um, yeah, this is my first stream at my dad's house. So, I mean, like, this is just, like, this is testing, like, my internet connection, the green screen, like, how everything looks. And I know now that the green screen doesn't work on my PlayStation. Um, I'm testing out, uh, just how chat is, how Nightbot's doing. Nightbot's not even on, I gotta enable him. Streamlabs, which I still have to enable. Um, other than that, I mean, like, so far the stream is going really good. Alright, so we have to do... Okay. Patience. District, Grim Haven Bay, Department, Surgery. Maybe it's Surgery? So he should be upstairs then. Tyler Sage. Hi. What's up? <laughs> Welcome. Me, it was the paint lady. Oh, dude. She is creepy. Yeah. I thought the painting You know, the painting was scarier, more scarier than the um than like it's becoming the painted lady. to you, mister. Pete. Explosion. Ew. Fishing with dynamite. Oh, hurts talking. I'm sorry. Bye. I don't think... Wait, Pete. Is that who we're looking for, Pete? Oh, that's totally him. Let me rest. Let me rest. Yeah, that's totally him. Unless if, um... He's up here. Oh, no, this is him. This is him. Yeesh. What happened to your shoulder? Uh, some psycho. In a bar brawl. Gun came out, he clipped me good in the shoulder. 
did he? Something I can help you with? Did he now? I'm just looking for someone. Uh, Captain Sanders. You had your kids watch Nightmare Captain on Elm Sanders. Street, second and third one through YouTube. Totally him. forgot about I'm the Joseph cursing. You, you <laughs> oh no! <laughs> really, Angel? Let me give you a call when you finish streaming. I gotta run to the store, live long, prosper. Mr. Spock, yeah. Well, shoot me a text because um, I'm gonna get some food. I might be, I might have some time. Uh, but I was gonna get some food before I picked up Caden. What time is it now? So I have like 30 minutes until I have to call out a stream and go get some food. Um, so let's hurry up and do this. <laughs> but yeah, yeah, just text me. The whole movie is on YouTube. Uh, which one? Which movie are you talking about? Hi, Moses. Why did you lie? It's funny. The records say you were admitted for an axe wound, just like a certain Captain Sanders got in the port massacre. Spill. Oh, to the depths with it. Who sent you? I'm asking the questions here, pal. Yeah, well, first tell me who you are. He's doing both, technically. I'm investigating the expedition. I'm investigating the visions. I kind of want to do the visions. I'm investigating the expedition. I'm investigating the visions. Oh, the Elm Street movie. Yeah, no, YouTube is actually... I like to rent movies on YouTube. One movie I saw recently was uh, Pet Cemetery, the new one. And it was good. I hated the ending, though. The ending wasn't that good. Um, I'm investigating the expedition. I'm investigating the visions. I don't know, because he, he really is doing both, so... Uh... We'll do the Charles visions. Reed. I'm a newcomer. I'm looking for the source of the Oakmont visions. We had them, my crew and I. And during the expedition, the dreams... You can't understand, Mr. Reed. Hmm. You weren't there. Hi, D nice. And Carlos. Hello. Uh what was the expedition looking what for? What were you looking for underwater? The cause of all this. The stones, the flood, the monsters. The scientists found cracks on the seabed. They were working on some theory of how it connected to the madness. The ocean floor splits open, and that means hysteria on land. Really. We spent days over the cracks. We heard things. Saw things looking back at us. Ready for the holiday wraps? I'm ready for the food. Oh, yes. No, my birthday is the day after Thanksgiving, so... Yeah. Plus, Kelly and David are gonna be here visiting. It's gonna be really fun. I think fun. it'd be an understatement <laughs> to say... <laughs> what about you guys? Are you guys ready? Disaster. For Thanksgiving? There are things that should never be found, Mr. Reed. I only wish I'd known that then. They'd still be alive. The scientists, my crew. Mm -hmm. None of them deserved what happened to them. Albert survived. Ooh! You know Albert Throgmorton made it to shore. Albert survived? Is he here? No. He didn't make it. He's dead as the rest. Murdered in the port. But what about the others? Uh, I don't know. Uh, we, um, uh, my crew left them down there, underwater. I ordered a rescue attempt, but they threatened mutiny. Subscribe? Aw. Thank you. You'll be watching streams tomorrow on your birthday. Wait, is tomorrow your birthday, Mike? Tomorrow? Oh my god. Okay. All right. I'll, uh, I might surprise you with something, Mike. <laughs> Happy early birthday. Um, what happened during the Tell final dive? What happened on the last dive. Oh yeah, my this god, that's exciting! Divers go down. Are you cold? Yeah, come up it's like 28 degrees time. here in Oklahoma. It sucks. But not once. I'm in California. Today. In the end, I sent a team to check. They returned with Albert. But all were half mad with fear. Hmm. You've got a good Car. reason for leaving the expedition to die, right? You, uh, you weren't there. Day after day on that ship, it was 
a horror mystery. You ready for turkey? You I've been eating chicken. I just had Subway things. sandwich meatball sub. Not Die. one of us dared sleep. It sounds filling. It was an expedition into cursed waters. Mark my words. Why were you I drinking? was on the Titania before I came here. It seems you were all hitting the bottle pretty hard. Why? To stop them from rioting. To save them from despair. After those dives, anyone would turn to drink. So, the diving did a number on your crew. What happened in the port? I don't know. They were... Okay. Where was your last you dive? Me out to where the last dive took place. No. No. You can't follow them, Mr. Reed. It's I'm not Navy suicide. Diver, Captain. And with all due respect, I don't Dang. Care. I'm not taking you there. And besides... Where can I get you know a diving I suit? Good... My men got theirs from a local factory. Where's the logbook from? Well, I had it with me, but I was all out of it by the time I got here. Get better. Okay, so we have to find his diary or his logbook for the, uh, the ship. So, what the hell? <laughs> um, so that's all the way down in the surgery, which is in the basement. And I think, I'm pretty sure there is monsters in the basement. So wish me luck, guys. I'm gonna go ahead and save just in case if we come across any monsters. I don't want to die. Haven't you been underwater already to find the scientist? Yeah, so this isn't my first time playing this game. I think I've got to, let's see. I was doing a bunch of side quests, but the story, I think I got to the point where I found the scientists underwater. And after that, it, you know, that's just a couple more quests to go. So I didn't really go that far in my first playthrough. And then my data, my data got um, erased. Oh god, there's probably gonna be monsters down here. Clear water? Yeah, huh? Yeah, huh? Sure. There we go. So scary. All evidence collected. Okay, good. No, one, no one's trying to kill me. Yay! <laughs> Yay! So let's do. Let's come up with a conclusion with what's going on. Is it all totally gone? Well, apparently, you know, Sock was telling me that there is a way to get your data back. Like it's saved digitally, like in your account. But I'm too lazy to <laughs> do that. So, I mean, I wasn't that far into the game, you know, it's okay. Um, Albert was the only one saved. The crew were riding and afraid of his insanity. They cast him adrift. Okay. Sanders told me his crew lost their minds after the expedition began. Expedition headquarters was vandalized by Innsmouthers. Um... Sanders told me his crew lost their mind. Madden started a massacre in the port as a result. Yeah. Yeah, okay, so we need to find more clues about this. Okay, look at his mustache. Be safe. We don't have any free beds left. <laughs> Did he just laugh at that? Okay. Cedar is hot. Okay, so now we have to go do what exactly? Um, there's like two places we have to go to. So the expedition's final dive was made near a cluster of underwater rocks. Known as the Devil's Teeth. The Devil's Teeth are not far from the Oakmont port. I have the coordinates and should be able to get there by boat. Sanders sent me to purchase diving suits from the factory, which is located in Western Grimhaven Bay on... Okay, well, we'll go here first. Grimhaven Bay. Western Grimhaven Bay. On Seasmith Avenue. Seasmith Avenue. Where... Here it is. Uh, between Levi Coffin Avenue and Deep Shore. 
by... So it's like right there? Okay. Nice. Hey, Rampage! <gasps> Westside is here! Hi, Westside! What's good? Okay. So guys, let me ask you this, like, how is the quality of the stream? Is it, um, is it running smoothly? Is it, does it look good? Is it blurry? Is it laggy? Cause, you know, this is my first stream back over at my dad's house, and I'm just seeing how everything goes. So far I haven't gotten any, like, notifications about any internet problems, which was pretty much happening at my house. <laughs> It's great so far. Hi, Albina! That's good. I'm so happy. Yeah, my house- you know what my house did? The internet at my house just like crashed my stream out of nowhere. So, that's good. It's perfect? Yay! It's running smooth. So like, even the quality, like the graphics look good. It's not pixelated. It looks very crisp. Volume is nice! Good! That's what I want to hear. That's great. Oh. I wish my green screen was good though. <laughs> That's the only thing I wish that was uh, working just fine. But yay, I'm so happy. Yes. <laughs> this test drive is going good. All right, so we have to find this factory to get like a diving suit. Okay. Is it this factory right here? Let's see. Oh, it's just on the other side. But yeah! It's great. Yeah, Angel, thank you. Guys, if you haven't liked the stream, I mean, this is my first stream back since being sick, I would appreciate all the support. Um, even if it's just a like. Uh, so please, go ahead and hit that like button. I would love that. Today is my first day feeling good. <laughs> All right, where are we going? Oh, we gotta go left, 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 eh! Ah! So it's right here. Wait, can I make any, can I make anything? Explosives? I'm waiting until we can get explosives. Um, to go fight that big monster. Ew. Hey! You nasty! Any more fuck. Can I level up? At least. Almost. Okay. Um we could probably make more bullets. Okay, we're out. Oh, there's something on the table right. Ew. What is that? Casings, okay. I need to find some alcohol. Is there anything in here? No. It is too quiet. Take that hard left, you ammo to create. Take that hard left. What? small items, but we can carry a whole damn diving suit? What? <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Why? <laughs> oh, that's my shadow. Okay, I was like... <laughs> See, you can't carry it. You can 
see that? I'm not trusting my life to a rusty suit. Oh, at least he knows. Looks like there's a basement, too. I'm not going down there. <laughs> Screw that. Can we level up? Now? No? Really? Okay, fine. Okay, so now we can... Go to this place. So it's over... Um... Is that it? I think we, we just have to go over there. Yeah, we should be good. Let's see you. hard to navigate this, like, from in reverse. Damn it, we're going the wrong way! <laughs> ah! Okay. People are gonna be cro shopping for Christmas early, too. I am going to be broke <laughs> for Christmas shopping. Honestly, because, like, I had to pay pretty much out of pocket for my doctor's appointment. Um, so, you know, unless, unless if Mr. Beast comes in, <laughs> which I doubt would happen. Okay, so we just have to go over there. Oh, you know what I forgot? The more we stay in the water, the more health we lose. So we can't even swim here. Alright. You have your glasses? Why don't you use them? Um, I have my glasses in my car. I just didn't think about it. I don't know. If I really feel the need to get them, then I'll I'll get them. I don't think it's really relevant right now to wear them. Not looking forward to November. My hubby and bestie birthday coming up in November. Dang. <laughs> now I understand, Angel. I totally understand. It's gonna be fun though. I mean, I'm excited for like Black Friday. My birthday is actually on Black Friday, so thank God it's on a Friday. <laughs> the cheapest day of the year too, technically. Okay, there should be a, a butt over here. A butt. Way? No, we gotta go to the third pier over here. Alright. Have you visited Jessica Albert lately out here in Kelly? Are you, <laughs> are you talking about Kelly now? <laughs> not, not recently. Alright, where is the boat? Oh, wait. What? Oh, right here. Huh. Okay. Well, that was fast. Time to go diving! Yay! All right, wish me luck, guys. Wish me luck. All right, so what are we supposed to be doing? Oh yeah, there's like monsters down here. Shit. I should have saved, damn it. There's like, Squid monsters down here. I gotta be super careful. Oh, guys, it's almost three o'clock, and I want to go get some like food before I get Caden from school. Um, let me check my PayPal because Mike said that he he told me to check my PayPal. 
whenever I got lunch, but I'll check right now. I don't have my Streamlabs open, so I haven't been like notifications. I have to remember or keep that in mind to have it ready whenever I stream. But I am checking right now. Mr. Mike, <laughs> I see you in chats. Oh snap, Mike! What is that, a $20 holla from Mike? Have some sushi, it's delicious. Oh, Mike, thank you! Guys, Mike, lunch is on Mike today. <laughs> I'm so happy. Thanks, Mike, you didn't have to do that. Your birthday's tomorrow. So you didn't have to get me lunch today. Let me save really quick. Um, but I am gonna call it a stream right now so I can get some food before I get Caden today. Um, but I am so happy that, like, everything is, like, going smooth, everything is, like, not laggy, it's not pixelated. So that is good. I'm very happy. Yeah, I gotta go get Caden. <laughs> um, but yeah, guys, thank you for joining me on this uh, test stream. I really should put, like, the game title in the stream just so people know um but yeah again guys thank you for joining me uh this was a pretty chill stream which i you know always like and i appreciate everybody being here um and thank you to everybody who liked the stream and subscribed and who's here watching so uh yeah i will be back on tomorrow i feel pretty good this week you know last week i had a lot of doctor's appointments uh because i was going through like a really i don't know like <laughs> it's kind of like I'll, I'll probably tell you guys in the future but yeah I had to go to the doctors last week because I wasn't feeling well um but I feel really good today and I will be back tomorrow um anyway take care everybody I'll probably be back with this game again because I really want to finish this game it's a really interesting game um so I hope you guys enjoyed it um yeah anyway Plus, I need to take care of my green screen. I have to find, like, a nice background or something for it. I don't know. Anyway, take care of Mike. Mike, I'll be sure to surprise you with something tomorrow uh, for your birthday. If, if you stop by the stream. I don't know what your plans are for tomorrow, but if you do, I'll, uh, you know, surprise you with, like, a birthday surprise. <laughs> you know? Uh, Angel, take care. Hugs to Kaden. Oh, thank you, Angel. Daniel, have a good day. Moses, Rampage, uh, take care, everybody. Happy early birthday, Mike. <laughs> Hope you have a good rest of your day, everybody. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye, everybody. Bye.